Hey guys, so one thing you might not know about me is that I really, really like protein bars. I eat pretty much one protein bar every single day. Uh, I've tried most of the popular protein bar brands out there, you know, from Quest Bars to One Bars to Robert Irvine's Fit Crunch to Optimum Nutrition's Bars to One Bars. I've tried most of them, right? But out of all of them, I think that this is pretty much the most underrated protein bar that I've ever tried. Let me explain. So... <clears throat> BSN is, you know, a really popular supplement brand. They've been making, you know, quality supplements for a long time. They have a really well-reviewed uh, line of protein powders and other supplements. Uh, but I don't know if too many people know about these protein bars. Like, I haven't even been able to find them in stores properly. The only place I buy these from is Amazon. Uh, it's a name that really intrigued me at first, right? Protein Crisp. So just judging by the packaging, it almost looks like it's a Rice Krispie treat, except, you know, protein bar. Uh, so I thought, why not give it a try? I bought a pack of 12 of these. I think they're about, uh, they work out to about $22 or so for an entire box, which is close to that $2 bar mark that's pretty common with, you know, even Quest Bars. It, it might even actually be slightly cheaper than Quest Bars. Before I dive into the taste of the bar, let me first uh, explain a couple of other things, a couple of reasons why I really like this protein bar. So yes, uh, as the name suggests, it is indeed really crispy. It's kind of like a Rice Krispies treat. Uh, it does live up to that expectation. It's really nice. Uh, but also, the macros are really good. So you have a total of 230 calories for the bar. And with that, you got 20 grams of protein, only 3 grams of sugar, and it's gluten-free for anyone who you know has gluten insensitivity or celiac. Um, also, the protein sources used in this bar are actually really, really high quality. So let me explain. A lot of uh, other protein bar companies... They, especially the cheaper ones, they tend to shove the product full of soy protein, which there's nothing inherently wrong with soy protein, but I feel like something like a whey protein is a lot higher quality. And in this case, as you can see, it starts off with a dairy protein blend, and the first ingredient in the bar is whey protein isolate, then whey protein concentrate. Yes, there is a little bit of soy protein in there, as well as, you know, dried egg whites and just, you know, other typical protein bar ingredients, but the whey protein isolate, the whey protein concentrate, the milk protein concentrate, all those are, you know, first and foremost in this protein bar. Yeah, even uh, macros wise, you know, it does compare quite favorably to something like a Quest bar. Uh, it might not have, it might have slightly more calories and slightly more sugar, but even then, I think it's really worth it for the trade-off. I don't think there's any other bar that I've tried yet that has this kind of uh, crispiness and crispy texture. So without further ado, let me crack this thing open. So I had to open this bar up off camera, uh, but check this out, guys. This looks really nice. You've got what looks like a, a chocolate base and then almost like a chocolate swirl. And then in terms of looks, this actually looks so much like a Rice Krispie Street. Um, it's really, really, you know, good looking. As soon as you open it too, it smells really nice. It doesn't smell artificial. It doesn't smell, you know, uh, bad like <laughs> some protein bars. This smells really, really good. So let me take a bite. Mm. Check out that inside, guys. Doesn't that look really, really like a Rice Krispies treat? Well, it does taste really darn good. The one knock I would have against it is... I think because of all the protein they put in there, the texture is actually a little bit drier than um, just an actual Rice Krispies treat. Uh, so you might need to have some water handy, but <laughs> overall, this is you know really incredible tasting. Uh, this is something I've been eating even when I'm not uh, trying to actively diet. When I even on days where I'm like throwing the diet out the window and not eating clean at all, I still eat one of these because that's how good they are. So this does have a few flavors. And this one is a s'mores, which is my favorite by far. And only other, oh, the only other favorite flavor I've tried is the chocolate one. And that wasn't really that good, honestly. It was, eh, it was pretty average, pretty mediocre in my experience. Uh, the s'mores one definitely tastes incredible. I would definitely uh, recommend this. You give this bar a try. It's a solid A plus for me. I will leave a link in the description so you guys know where to find it. Um, but yeah, let me know. Is there any other protein bar I should try out? You know, I've you know I've tried a whole bunch of them, and I'm still looking for uh, you know more protein bars to try and just add to my rotation. If you like this video, a like would be awesome. Uh, leave me a comment and some feedback uh, if you want, and of course, a subscribe to this channel would be much appreciated.